Welcome back everyone, Criminal Archer here, time for some more Project Zomboid. So we're going to just cross over here, try to get into some of these houses, because there doesn't seem to be as many zombies over here, for the moment anyways. Apparently I got into that house down there at some point. Alright, no alarm please. Alarm would be a very bad thing for me at this moment. Oh, hello. Come on. Alright, we're good. Water bottle on here. Nothing. Hey, butter knife. Take the salt. Butter knife's good for like three pokes. Nothing there. Hello, zombie. She explode. Nothing there. Oh, a baseball bat. Sweet Jesus, a baseball bat. Bath towels. Of course, its condition is not not great. Not gonna build its spike baseball bat right now. Stick to just the regular thing. Can't, aff can't afford the loss of condition that happens when you make a spike baseball bat. Here she comes. Try to preserve the condition of this thing as long as I possibly can. Oh, you stay down. Please, thank you. Door, door, door. No alarm. I hate the tiny sound of tone. Hunter magazine. Let's read that. Teach us how to do traps. Yep. Orange soda. Another frying pan, good. Do I not have any space in here? Oh, I have plenty of space, all right. Of course I'm overloaded now. By the standards of this game, so far this is a pretty good house. Found more than one thing of use, so it's a good house. Bathroom? Nothing. Nothing. Alright. We apparently hit that house on the end, because it's got its door open, so we'll keep going this way. We should eat something. I'll just eat this bag of chips. Right now we don't care if we get fat. It's actually kind of the goal. Alright, zombies. 
By yourself, huh? Next. Here they come. Good solid whack. Another one. Push, stomp. And push and stomp and push and stomp. He always stomps with the same leg. Seems like he needs to mix it up or else he's gonna get gonna get jacked in an uneven manner. Be half jacked. Be like, what's with the swole leg? Well it's my zombie stomping leg. Hello. Expect another one any second. There he is. Cool. Alright, I know there's more of you in there. You coming? Nope. Alright. Well, I'm coming to you then. There you are. I saw them outside the window. Oh. Hey. Two at a time. That's not fair. Alright. Come on. Get you. Get you. Okay. Hey, key. We good now? This house is ours for the picking. Sardines. This bag. Capacity 10, weight reduction 30. Capacity 19, weight reduction 10. Well, I'll take it. I'm not sure exactly what to do with that. Probably some math that needs to get done to know which one, which better that, which way that goes better. Let's see. Journal and a magazine. Come on, just give me a decent bag. So much to ask. It's like a duffel bag. Even a school bag. Something I can put on my back. Nope. Apparently that is too much to ask. Alright. Next place. Hey, a car! I guess they have put cars into the game. I think somebody said that to me in the comments. That somebody had, that the, the creator of this map had updated it with a, some car spawns, not very many, but some. the other one. Did you go back out the window? She went back out the window. And a car key. Which is probably to that car that's outside. Nice. Anything in here? No. Lighter. I don't know if we have a lighter or not yet. But we do now. That's for sure. Chips ramen. Should take this cooking pot. Peanut butter. Apparently there are a large number of zombies nearby. <laughs> I can hear them. Going upstairs is probably a bad idea in this current situation, especially since there are zombies up here. Alright, never mind. Need a bag of chips just to get a little bit of a strength boost from hunger. 
which is still not quite enough. All right, let's go back to the house. Oh, hello. Where'd you all come from? <laughs> and another set there. Okay, this is going to be fun. Now I get to play the game. Try to get home without getting killed while you're overloaded. It's a fun game. Through the building, this might work a little bit better. To clear the stuff on the other side here. Cool, cool. Oh, zombies. They don't actually seem to be following me though. It looks like they're going to the sound of that breaking glass. Now those zombies on the other hand are a problem. Closing in on me. Tightening the noose. I'm going to drop our stuff off before I worry about them, though. That's too much stuff. Pretty sure one of them saw us. So slow. Scoot, scoot, scoot. Made it to the fridge. Chips. Dry ramen. Somebody's here. Salt and pepper. Cooking thing. Strawberry seeds. Sugar. Golf club. One of these frying pans. I said sugar already. Alright, I think we're okay. Let's sit here in this chair and rest for a second. See if we can clear our exertion. There it goes. Okay. Now, let's deal with this rabble. Alright, first up, I'm going to equip this butter knife and we're going to deal with as many as we can, butter knife style. Where'd they go? Where'd you go, zombies? I hear you. Nope, nope, wrong way. There we go. Should probably attract the attention of the others. Yep, here they come. Out of the trees. Bullets there. Oh, here they come. Come on, knife. Hang with me. Stay with me, knife. There it goes. you got what else you got bring it on put your dukes up All right, let's deal with some of these zombies over here stupid broken butter knife I should look at a map see where I am in this town 
some idea where we should go. Good old sound. I feel like this game would be a extremely, like a degree of magnitude more difficult if you were deaf. I didn't, I, I played once a very, very long time ago. I played with the deaf trait. It was weird. Oh. This is going to be fun. Alright, I think we're just going to take these people away. Come this way. I'm going to go for a walk. Just going to collect all these zombies. Oh, that was a little too close, almost got grabbed. Alright, everybody. Come with me. I think I'm actually losing most of them. I refuse. I refuse. Not again. Not again. Not again. Not again. Oh, it's totally happening again. Why am I having so much trouble with this? Scratched. Oh, nice. Getting greedy. That's my problem is I'm getting greedy. We may or may not be zombified. It's basically the moral of the story here. Sorry, I don't know why I keep getting so greedy. Gotta stop it. All right, we are okay for the moment. Need food. Weapon, please. Thank you. Problem is, I think we have hy hypochondriac too. Oh, not this. Hemophobic, hypochondriac. Yeah. So we're not really gonna know if we're zombified or not for a long time. It's very sloppy of me. I guess it's been too long with high at high skill levels. Like when I was playing my previous like my previous long game. I spent so long with like all of my skills so far maxed out that I got used to being able to do the things that I could do at that level. <laughs> and so now I'm getting into trouble because I'm not uh, not appreciating the fact that I'm not at that level anymore. Fall down. Alright. Pretty banded chip. That tracks. Alright, so don't need these. Some 
Disinfectants. It's probably more disinfecting than we need to do, but whatever. Alright, let me rip up some more clothes here. Do I have any other ripped sheets? For some reason I thought I'd rip some up. It must have been a previous game where I ripped some up right away. It's usually something I do pretty early on. Alright, let's get these couple of zombies that are here. Let's see, three, four, five? Maybe not. Anybody's wandered into our house while we were gone. Seems to be okay. Alright, well I'm going to stop here. And I will probably play a little bit more off camera. Just to see if any zombification stuff starts to kick in. Um, if it does, I'll probably just let the character die. And I'll see you guys later. Thanks so much.